This is Nick with Build Brothers Roofing at 634 Cadman Street. Uh, out here in San Diego, starting my digital inspection, we are on top of an older three-tap shingle roof. This is the second layer of shingle that is on this property. We can see we've got a lot of damage on this roof that's already starting to occur. So obviously this roof is, you know, has gone past its life expectancy. But this is the original layer of shingle that's on this roof. Um, this shingle has just been blown off, apparently. Um, but you can see that, you know, the bottom layer is obviously starting to crumble. Um, and the actual material that's on the roof itself is starting to fade away as well. You can, you'll notice that there is a ton of granule loss that is starting to occur that it has been occurring on this three cap shingle product the oils have started to evaporate uh, on the shingle um, causing all the fiberglass to be exposed you can see that we have a bunch of missing shingles on this property as well um, and then the rest of the shingles are really just kind of flapping around in the wind they're just super super loose at the moment um, so these are all telltale signs that the product itself has gone past its life expectancy I'll point out a few other things. So we have more missing shingles on this side. Obviously more ridge caps that are, you know, starting to dis disintegrate at this point. Um, a lot of missing shingles along the perimeter of the roof itself. You can see that all the drip edge is completely exposed at this point. Um, and water is now just penetrating underneath that every single time that it rains. More missing shingles on this side. And then again, more damage over here as well. You can see that water's just been soaking in here for quite some time. Um, so yeah, in my personal opinion, obviously this roof needs to be replaced. Um, there isn't any time left on this roof. Uh, if another big stor storm comes through, there's a good chance that it's really gonna start to leak quickly for the homeowner. Uh, my suggestion is that we go with a full tear off on this property. We'll tear this thing down to the wood decking itself. And that way we can address any kind of bad wood that is underneath this, uh, this roof. Once that new, uh, once that, once the roof is tore off, we'll go ahead and add a layer of synthetic underlayment to this property. We're an Owens Corning preferred contractor. That underlayment is part of the Owens Corning roofing system and will come with a 50 year warranty from them to go along with a 10 year workmanship warranty uh, from us over at Build Brothers. Once that new synthetic underlayment is installed, we then install a starter shingle along the entire perimeter of the roof, along with brand new drip edge along the perimeter of the roof as well. And then the actual architectural shingle goes right on top of it. And now the homeowner has a roof that they will no longer have to deal with uh, for the next 30, 35 years or so. Um, we, don't, we can also see that this current roof, roof has a bunch of exposed nail heads on it. Uh, every single ridge cap has an exposed nail head. These are all leaks waiting to happen. We don't want to have any exposed nail heads on our roof. Uh, job this size will take our crew uh, two, maybe three days to complete. Depending on the amount of wood that we have on this project, wood repair is always an unknown variable. Um, this home is uh, owned by a past customer of ours, so they understand how that wood repair goes. But yes, in my professional opinion, this roof needs to be replaced. That's it for my inspection.